guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing my April 2016 Boxy Charm unboxing. I'm just gonna go ahead and jump right into this video. So if you'd like to see what I got this month in my Boxy Charm, then just stay tuned. So the first thing that I see in my box, which I'm actually really, really excited for, because if you saw my last month's video, you know that I was kind of upset that this wasn't in there anymore, which is the card with everything listed on the back side. So this month's theme for BoxyCharm is Cloudy with a Chance of Charms. And I'm just gonna go ahead and jump in with the first thing on the card, which is the Pearly's Lip Comfort. And this is a full size product and it's $16. And it says it is a daily lip nourisher with mango and shea butter, hydrates and nourishes, heals and softens. Um, and that it's for all skin types. And I'm actually really excited for this because I don't have chapped lips, I just have really dry lips. And I love to find anything that's gonna help my lips stay more moisturized. So I'm really excited for that. And I love anything with mango and shea butter in it. So the next product on the list is something that we've gotten before. Um, well, a company that we've gotten before. And this is Blink Cosmetics. And this is a full-size product for $26. And this is a black lash primer. Now, I actually really do not like the Blink Mascara. Um, the one where it just puts like little tubes over your eyelashes and I actually gave it away and I've actually never used a lash primer before so I am kind of curious to try a lash primer. I'm not so curious to use Blank Cosmetics if it's anything like their mascara is and their mascara was just really too dry for me. Um, so I hope that this is not like that and it says that this is supposed to give you fuller and thicker lashes. So maybe I'll use this in a tutorial and see how it is. Maybe I'll do like a first impression or something or even a review on it to see how much I like it because like I said, I didn't really like the mascara and I gave it away. So the next thing on the list is this Anderson Lily Manhattan Beach Butter Hand Cream. And this says that it is a full size product and retails for $24. I have been using this past couple days and I actually really, really like it. I think this, and this is only using it for a couple days, but I think this is one of my favorite hand creams that I've ever actually tried. I love the way that it leaves my hands feeling. And I think it smells really good. And it makes my hands, like once I put it on, it makes it feel like there's a cool, something that cools it inside. It just leaves my hands feeling really soft and it stays on there, but it doesn't make my hands feel greasy or overly lotioned or anything like slippery or anything like that. It just makes it feel really nice and soft. And like I said, I love the smell in it. It has like citrus and um, white jasmine in it. And I actually have like really dry um, ankles. I know that is so weird, but I have really dry ankles. So I'm actually gonna put this on my ankles and see how it works with like the dry spots and everything. So I'm really excited to use this more. I'm actually kind of curious about more products from the brand. So the next thing on this list, Generals Eyeshadow is a loose eyeshadow. It's a full size and it retails for $21. I said before that I wasn't really interested in loose pigments or uh, loose eyeshadows and stuff like that. And I get them all the time. And I've been talking about how I wanted to try to use them more to see how I liked them. And I really think that this one is a really beautiful color. It is in the shade Brown Hypnotic. Um, it kind of looks like a purplish brown with some gold. It kind of looks like it has copper reflex in it. I don't know. I actually really do like the brand. I don't know, like this isn't my favorite thing, but it also isn't my least favorite. So I'm gonna try that out and then I'll let you guys know what I think of it because I think it's a really pretty color. So the last thing in this month's box is this Ofra Cosmetics Long Lasting Liquid Lipstick in the shade Pasadena. It is a full size product and retails for $19.90. Um, I love Ofra Cosmetics. I love their liquid lipsticks. They're very, they're very moussey liquid lipsticks so they do transfer. I think the shade is really beautiful. Um, I love getting liquid lipsticks in my boxes and bags and everything because they are one of my favorite things about makeup. I'm like completely in love with anything liquid lipstick. I've been really excited getting all these liquid lipsticks that I have. Um, this is the second liquid lipstick from Ofra that I've got in my BoxyCharm. I really do like the brand. 
and they are a liquid lipstick that I would recommend because they do have a couple of them besides the ones that I've gotten in BoxyCharm. So that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. Let me know what you liked from BoxyCharm. Let me know what you didn't like from BoxyCharm. And yeah, I guess I'll see you guys in my next video. Yeah.